Welcome back. Welcome back, family. Welcome back. All right, so guys, this is the general message. I just did the elemental air signs, water, fire, uh, and earth. So you guys can go and check that out. This reading, you know, um, as I'm meditating, I'm asking spirit to help me deliver a message that's important for all 12 signs to know, okay? So it doesn't matter what sign you are. This is for all 12 signs. This is a general message for all 12 signs. Okay, so y'all know, if you've already watched your reading, that I ordered some new decks, okay? Because sometimes the, the higher self and, and the flesh, they ain't on the same page. So, I asked Spirit with these these uh, specific cards, these are the soul's journey. I asked Spirit to, um, whatever card files out, this is what your higher self wants you to know, wants your flesh to know, okay? Because, you know, we out here living in 3D, we're living in our flesh and our ego, but our higher self always knows what's best for us. And so whatever card pops out with this is what spirit is telling you your higher self wants you to know. All right. These new cards bear with me as I shuffle these things. Try to anyway. Hell, I don't want them to get all bent out of shape either, right? Okay, that's a little bit better. Okay, Spirit. Thank you. Discipline. I can accomplish what I, what I set my mind to. All right, this is for all 12 signs. Discipline. Let me show it to y'all. Okay. Now... So that's what your higher self wants you to know. You, you can get, you can go out there and, and accomplish whatever you put your mind to with discipline. Okay. So now these cards that come up, this is the wisdom of the oracle. All right. I love these cards. I love these freaking cards. So this is gonna tell us what's going on. And, you know, I'm going to pull three cards. Maybe all three cards, because these three cards, each card is going to be a message. Maybe all three of them will resonate with you. Maybe one or maybe two. But, you know, one of these one of these are going to resonate. Because that's what I already asked Spirit to do. I asked Spirit to give me a message that all 12 of my signs need to hear the most. Okay? Hopefully all three of them don't resonate with you. Because then that means your life just... You know, kind of messed up a little bit, but we're going to get it together. Okay, higher power. Yes. That was, oh, yes, honey. I love it. I love it. So are some of my people waking up? Are some of my people starting to realize that there is something bigger out here? I hope so. Because I told y'all, that's my, that's my goal. Wake y'all up. Self, the fates. This is about somebody's spiritual journey. This is, I don't care what nobody say. Thank you, Spirit. Look, let me finish getting these. I be getting so excited. Let me finish getting the cards out here, and, I, and I'll show y'all. But this is absolutely about somebody realizing um, that they're on a spiritual journey. Somebody waking up to the higher power, right, to their destiny, right? That's too many cards, Spirit. Somebody realizing. Child, I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it, I love it. Happy, happy. Aww. Look at me. I'm a big-ass 35-year-old kid. But the only reason I get like this is because I've been on this spiritual path for, you know, a year and a half now. And so, oh, my gosh. So many things that didn't make sense, you know, where I was just living my life, just moving, just freaking existing. It's like once I started to manifest, when I, once I started to trust my intuition and go within, right, and get the answers from the higher power. Look at this car real close. Dang, this camera ain't no good. First of all, it say higher power down here. But you see, this is a woman. She getting answers from source. That's her third eye woke up. You see that eye in the middle of them eyeball? That keyhole in the middle of her two eyes is her third eye awakening. And spirit, the source, God, angels, whatever, is giving this person answers, knowledge. Child, yes. This is the fates. 
the fates. This means this is destiny. This is, you know, this is a divinely guided situation. Okay? So now, this person is protected. You see those stars? To me, those stars in this card represent all her spirit guides, her spiritual team that's protecting her. And the biggest star, that's all the information that she has received from spirit once her third eye opened. Okay? And she happy, happy. She's protected by her spirit guides and angels, right? She's full of knowledge. And she glowing. You see the star on her forehead? It's like it's almost like when she walk out into the world, people know something different about her. This is a divine feminine. I made a video called The Divine Feminine um, a few months ago. And I said in that video, when you walk out and you, you know, you're around other people, even when you leave, that light that's on you, shining within you, look at that big ass star in the middle of her chest. That's the divine shining through this person. Okay, this is the divine feminine, or it could be a divine masculine. You know, I'm reading energy, but somebody has woke up. Oh, my God. And somebody's starting to realize that with discipline, they can have whatever they want. They can be whatever they want. Spirit done came through and told this person. Oh, my gosh. This is so freaking beautiful already, and I don't even have no cards out here to clarify. It's almost like, what do I need to clarify? There's a higher power. This was divinely guided. And we're dealing with somebody that's divine. Oh, my gosh. Okay, let me get out my feelings. Spirit, give me King of Cups. Yes, baby. The King of Cups energy is just full of love, right? Full of freaking love to give. Not only themselves, but to somebody else. Okay? In this reading, that's what I'm picking up. This person has unconditional love for themselves and they have so much to give they have so much love and wisdom to give this person does that i'm reading for this is for all 12 signs okay the knight of one this person has been wounded don't get it twisted i told y'all in another video when you go through your spiritual awakening you're gonna go through it you're gonna go through it physically mentally you're gonna go through it in all ways but the happy, happy, this is the end result. When you come out on the other side of this thing, you're going to be so happy with yourself, you know. But, you know, this 9 one coming up under this fate, this was destined to happen, okay? You have to know this. Whoever I'm talking to, this was destined to happen. The car had flipped over. I don't see it. I see the Ten of Cups at the bottom. Wow. What? Thank you, Spirit. I can't make this stuff up. Guys, the magician. You know, so, okay, listen. Yes, you had to go through some stuff, right? Going through the spiritual awakening, right? Because you, I think about it. When spirit is pouring in knowledge, when spirit is pouring in, it, it can be physically painful too, right? Uh, mentally too because it, it, it's probably going to go against everything you thought you knew prior to you going on this spiritual awakening prior to you waking up to this higher power that you have within yourself right the higher power that you have within yourself and the higher power that is the creator right oh my god like i said you're going to be happy this is divinely guided this is fates this was supposed to happen with the happy, happy car, you know why she's so damn happy? Because she the magician now. This person realized that they have everything that they need to manifest whatever it is that they want in life. This person realized just how powerful they are. Man, wow. This is serious, y'all. This is really serious and it's so beautiful. Let me just get one more card. I don't even want I don't even want to clarify this no more. I'm not. That's it. That's it. You're gonna go through it, honey. I don't know why I move the cards around. You this person, whoever is going through this spiritual awakening, you gonna go through it. Okay? The most high is enlightening you. It show it shows right here on the dang on card. All that that is light coming from spirit into your third eye. 
That's wisdom, knowledge. Your DNA codes is breaking. Man, listen, that's secret knowledge. Everybody don't have that. Everybody ain't going through this spiritual awakening. Right? And you got to know that when spirit giving you some secret knowledge, you don't think you're going to go through it? Yeah, you're going to go through it. But the, the, the end result, happy, happy. Why she so damn happy? Look at those. Are, uh, look at that rainbow behind. That's energy. Right? This person is manifesting whatever. You know why she happy, happy? Because she, now she knows she's the magician. He or she realizes that they are the magician. They can do whatever. They can have whatever. I love this, y'all. I'm sorry it took 10 minutes for this to come out, but it is what it is. With discipline. With discipline. You can accomplish whatever you set your mind to. All right, till next time. Bye.